So you and Don are teamed up, technically, correct. right? That is correct. So Don, about a little over a year ago, um, well, almost two years ago now, um, got her license. And then she left her job of 15 years um, where she was doing very well and loved and everything else. But she was just ready for a change. And she wanted to travel with me. She got tired of me going and having all the fun and going to all the fun places and seeing all the beautiful places. And she says, I'm going with you. And so um, she went to work for a company as a file reviewer. And um, she ended up just being so busy. She was stuck to her desk working 12 hour days. It wasn't working out so well. And then she left that. I just told her one day, I said, just quit. Just, you know, just quit. We can, we don't need your income. Let's just quit. So she quit. Now she supports me. Um, she sets up my files. She does my scheduling. Um, she labels my photos. That is like the greatest thing in the world. I have my own oh. personal. Oh. <laughs> personal nice. label my photos. Oh boy. Um, and so all I do is I run around and scope and I get back and I write the estimate mm -hmm. and and uh, we're done. I mean, I'm done every day by five o'clock. I mean, I'm, I'm literally working an eight to five job right nice. now. And so, um, but so, yeah, so she's, and she's loving it. And so she also gets time to, we're, we're staying in a resort right now. So she has time to still go out and do stuff and have fun. And, and, uh, and she's working part time, basically, other than the foul um, picture labeling part, which I hate. She goes, oh, I don't sure. mind doing it. So what qualification? Yeah. So what uh what qualifications or like skills do you think Don or or like your partner like this would need to have like to make this work? Patience. Um so organization. You have to be very organized. Patience with you. Yeah, patience with me, of course. Uh you've got to be organized. And uh, so when it's your spouse, the there's there's a dynamic there because of course one of you has the experience and one of you doesn't. So one of you has to take the lead. And Don and I have a very, a very partnership type relationship. Okay. We discuss things. We, we make decisions together. Um, you know, we, we just have this really partnership. So it's, no, there's neither one of us really is the, you know, runs the house or whatever you want to call it. And, but in this role, because I have the experience, I have to take the lead and I have to be the one who directs traffic. I have to say, okay, we got to do this. You got to do this. You got to do this. And if your spouse is one of those people that can't um, can't take that and can't you know take your lead, it'll be problems. I've seen actually another couple that has tried this and they failed miserably, and that was because the the one spouse that wasn't the adjuster first started becoming resentful because they felt like they were being bossed around all the time. Okay. Uh -huh. Well, and again in this scenario, somebody has to take the lead. But uh, at the same time, because she does my scheduling, she's telling me where to go all the time. So she's, uh, I said, well, why would you schedule me like this? And she says, because I thought, thought it was the best way to do it. Okay, I'm not going to argue. I can make changes if I want to. But, you know, she has the freedom to make decisions. Okay, but at the same time, I, I'm the one who prioritizes things and, and gotcha. kind of sets the tone. And, and so, so, but she's very, very organized, whereas I'm a fly by the seat of my pants kind of person. And I'm not really all that organized. So having her, that balance is great having her there doing that. But definitely have to be organized. Um, has, you have to be a quick learner because, especially with somebody like me who doesn't have a lot of patience um, sometimes. Um, I mean, I have patience, but I just don't like using it all in one person. Um, and <laughs> so it's, so just, you, they have to have patience. You have to have patience. But for them, it's just you have to be organized. You have to be a quick learner. Um, have to be willing to ask questions. You have to be able to, they have to be able to set their, their personal feelings about any subject aside. Okay. If you had a bad day the day before you, you had a bad, let's say you, you're having a disagreement about something that has to be set aside whenever you're getting the work done. But I will tell you this, having your wife be your partner and having your wife to be your assistant. Cause I know some people that they hire people to do stuff like this for them. Well, my wife has a vested interest in making sure that I succeed. Okay. My wife has a vested interest to make sure that it, that I'm not overworked every day. Okay. Because she benefits from that. Okay. Uh, she benefits from me being organized, being more efficient, making more money. Um, and she also has, wants the benefit of me not being so tired that we don't have time together. So it, it works out great. One of the best things about having, I know this is 
kind of going off from the question you asked. No, you're fine. But one of the best things about having your spouse helping you in this, <clears throat> so some people say, well, my wife's income, I haven't made it that far as an adjuster yet, or my adjuster income, I'm not sure can replace hers. Well, if you think about it for a second, if, if like with her doing my scheduling, she's actually stepped up now and doing my supplements for me, okay? She's, she's progressed into that. She's even started writing some, she's even started writing some of my estimates for me. Uh, she'll just jump in and see it. She'll write it, just have me to look it over. So what does it actually look like when adjusters with decades of experience between them scope a hail damaged house? On video, what about how to actually do a claim in Xactimate? What is stability and how do you even get started in it? What if there was one place, one huge and expanding library of property claim suggesting videos showing how it's done? What if there were also complete Xactimate certifications as well as the latest and most up-to-date Xactimate mobile training? You know, what if? What if the dream was a reality? Get started for free binging all the desk and field claims adjusting videos you can stand right now at adjustertvplus.com. Think of it as a virtual ride-along. Speaking of ride-alongs, click here to get right along to the next video. Because it's a, well, do you see how it's, it's a pun, you see? Ride along. Get it right. Just move right along versus ride along. It's right along. Get right along to it. Thank you.